much. Filmmakers from across the Midwest are showcasing their talent this weekend in Topeka. It's Washburn's Wi-Fi Film Festival. Jess Seidel and Matthew Nyquist are here with the details. Welcome to both of you. Thank you. So explain what Wi-Fi Film Festival means. It doesn't have to do with internet access. And is, is Wi-Fi how you actually say it, or do you guys say it differently? We do say it Wi-Fi. Um, it is the film festival okay. that Washburn University hosts, and Matt is the founding executive of it. What, yeah, it, what was your goal? Um, so really to smash the barriers between the Midwest and the professional film industry, give Midwesterners a chance to showcase their work alongside high-quality international works and bring Hollywood professionals to Topeka. So we're going to have all sorts of that going all on this weekend, stuff. but also local filmmakers. And Jess, you're a filmmaker, and I understand women in film is one of the themes this year. How is that going to play out? It is. So we do, every year we have a women's panel where we have a bunch of local filmmakers that are women that come and speak. It's one of the many workshops that we get to do during Wi-Fi. Um, really looking forward to it this year. And we have a lot of really amazing films that have also been submitted by women that are be showing. What is your favorite that you see on the list? Um, I was really a fan of um, Syncopat is an amazing film that we've gotten in. We've got uh, Chairs is also a really uh, well-received one that we've gotten. And then we've got a bunch of local filmmakers. We've got Washburn students and alumni, as well as a high school student submission. Nice. Hey, do you have a film in? I do. Um, I was a writer on a project that was made at Washburn last year, and it is in this year's uh, film festival. And then I'm currently directing a film that will hopefully be finished by the end of this semester, and we'll see it next year at Wi Fi. Very cool. And Matthew, when you talk about this blend that you have mm -hmm. of professionals coming in, but then also local homegrown talent, mm -hmm. how does that really feed into the vision on how this is unfolded? It's it's really kind of the, the whole the whole point of, of blending these two together and getting people to be able to interact that wouldn't normally interact. We have a featured guest um, who's directed a film that Steven Spielberg produced. He also started his career with James Cameron and people like that. So he's bringing lots of industry experience um, and giving a, a workshop and a talk on uh, Saturday night. I was going to say, so during the day, it's at the library and yes. people can go watch the films, yes. hear panels and that sort of thing. And then the evening switches over to the Washburn campus and that's when we'll have your very, very special guest. Yes. Everybody's uh, a special guest, but right. this is a very, very special yes. guest. Yes, <laughs> and everything is free. I should say all the film screenings, all the workshops, everything is 100% free. There's no barrier to entry at all. And it's a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Why do you both recommend people go and check this out? Because it's not like you're talking, you're not going to watch Jaws when you go to this. Right. But these are, there's something magical about these yes. undiscovered films. Well, I would say um, the films are entertaining. Yes. Like we, we do try to make sure that the films are actually fun to watch and entertaining and not, you know, something that you have to have like a film degree to mm -hmm. enjoy. Um, and then the workshops, people will um, learn a lot and have a lot of interaction. Um, we have a professional screenwriter from L.A. that's going to give a screenwriting workshop. Um, and then a lot of local folks that are giving great ones as well. And what about for you, Jess? Your I think, pitch, I think it's up. amazing because Washburn students are such a huge part of this festival and it really is a staple of the community and it's something that the local community could be really proud of. And then of course all the amazing workshops and all the amazing films. And it's really fun to show up. You know, sometimes you want to watch a long like two hour movie and it's great, but these are all short films. So you get to watch 26 films over the course of a day. Fantastic. It all starts on Saturday at 10 a.m. over at the Topeka and Shawnee County Public Library, followed by the Filmmaker Talk and Reception, 5.30 over at the Rita Blit Gallery at Washburn University. Jess, Matthew, thank you so much. Have a great time this weekend. Thank you. We are going to invite you to Corks and Forks next.